Welcome to day four of Vlogmas, where God only knows what's going to happen. Christmas times. We'll be chilling and having a good, good time. Doesn't matter if the snow is falling. Just come in the video. Good morning. Good morning. <laughs> if I don't get my flatulence under control, I'm going to the doctor. Good morning, Duncan. Good morning, Snickers. Good morning. Good morning, Dobby. Good morning, Harlow. I cannot believe it's 5.50 in the morning and I'm up. First vlog in the new house. There's a lot of blue in here, so you're probably gonna notice an absurd amount of the color teal. And I think by the end of Vlogmas, it's gonna be all of our favorite colors. I'm so happy to finally just be here. I am really excited to just be vlogging and to feel more like I'm making a Vlogmas vlog of me just spending my days with you guys every single day. I didn't have any coffee or caffeine yesterday. Since I'm up this early, I figured I would just start to vlog. I tried to fall back asleep. It's not gonna happen for me. We do have things to do though. Duncan is getting groomed. He's just, the Frito feet are kind of a lot right now. And Duncan's getting fixed on the 9th. Yeah, you're getting fixed. Oh shit! Mm -hmm. And I want him to be like clean. I don't know, it just seems right. You're getting surgery, get groomed before. Last night, Mama Kelly came over and helped me put up my Christmas tree. I didn't vlog last night, but I did vlog that for you. Roll those clips. Guess who came over to help me put up my Christmas tree? Mrs. Claus. Mama Kelly Claus. KC with the double B. <laughs> Mama Kelly picked up a Christmas tree for me and we're not gonna decorate it or anything, but I can't be in this house without a Christmas tree. She has one, I don't know what the problem is. Really, you wanna see it? It deserves a close up, I think. I do, it's really special. I'm not really sure why, like, I mean, to each their own, I guess. It looks like they forgot to finish making it. I know, it belongs in the desert. This is the Christmas tree that's in here. It's sweet that they would decorate it. <laughs> But, mm -mm. this is Vlogmas. We're having a nice tree. I have a dance for you. I know you love learning dances. Oh, okay, I'm ready. Do you have like a fastener in your hand? You're gonna go like this. Da 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 I'm cracking under pressure. Yeah, you're really good at this dance. <laughs> dun 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 Yeah, so you dun, dance. Dun, dun. That's an old Christmas song. Oh. Okay, three times. Ta-da! Ta Merry Christmas! High five, good job. Thank you very much, I appreciate it. I can be hired out if you need help around the house. I'm really good at watching TV while you work. <laughs> right? Yeah. It's no. very pretty. Let's see what the lights are. Aww. Aww. It's like this time. I was waiting for you to come. Me too. Very happy time. It's very happy Christmas time. We also went to PetSmart because I needed to get some food. This tie out so Duncan can run around outside without getting hit by a car. This is one of those things that I probably wouldn't show you guys if it wasn't Vlogmas. Because there's a part of me that says maybe it's unnecessary. But it's Vlogmas so I get to show you guys all the stupid things. They had an entire Harry Potter section. 
I'm a Hufflepuff. Definitely my nature is not a Hufflepuff. So I probably should have got him his house. We're gonna put it on him just to punish him for waking me up early this morning barking. Look at him stand up between my feet. <laughs> hates it. You're a Hufflepuff. Long live Hufflepuffs. His appointment is at 9, so I'm gonna leave and go to Mama Kelly's house at 8. And it's currently 6, which gives me two hours to get ready, make the thumbnail, and make sure everything is done for today's vlog that needs to go up. Did I say everything already? And stopping at coffee. We're gonna get coffee, don't worry. Don't worry. I got this at Gerald's house. It's an advent calendar, but with dog treats. Yeah. For Duncan, I thought that would be fun to see him open this every day. And it's already day four. Do you want to open four treats, Duncan? This is so fun. All of the angles are new, so you can't be bored of them yet. I also bought him a bed, but you can't really see it. He's sitting on it, though. Today we're doing this before breakfast, but for the rest of the days, you're not going to get that lucky. Come here. Come here. You see this? It's day one. Duncan, come. Come here. How did I get a dog that doesn't want a treat? He, he's not eating them. I just put a tank top on and changed into some leggings. <coughs> I'm staying in comfy clothes because my mom and I are just gonna be decorating her house. And I don't know if you guys remember Mama Kelly's house, but it's large. So it's gonna be a lot of movement and I wanna feel free. Chapstick and mascara. Threw my hair in this thing. That's all it is. And this is my perfume. It's absurdly expensive, I will admit. But if you spray this on you, you will smell like it for days. It doesn't go away. It just smells so good. And anytime I go out in this, I'm constantly getting compliments. I'm not saying that to brain. I'm just saying it to be honest. If I'm going places during the day, I have to bring, oh my gosh, there's so much in this backpack. If I'm going somewhere during the day, I have to bring whatever I need that day for like vlogging and stuff. You never know what might happen. coffee. I'm gonna go get Dunkin'. Okay, yes. The infamous Dunkin' Donuts. I'm really hungry right now. Very much so. Would love to go get a breakfast sandwich from somewhere, but I'm not going to because with Thanksgiving and my road trip, I kind of just ate whatever <laughs> I wanted to. I'm feeling pretty bleh. I'm gonna try and be a little more healthy. Also something now that I'm finally here, I have to figure out where I'm gonna work out because I'm not gonna just not work out for the whole month while I'm here. There's a line with Duncan. A lot has changed since I moved. So I'll update you guys when I figure that out. Could I please have the toasted white chocolate latte? And then could I get two extra shots of espresso in that? Could I get two of the wake up wraps? Bacon, egg and cheese, and a sausage egg and cheese? And then that's it. All right, we'll see you in the window. Thank you. Did I cave under the pressure? Yeah, I did. I definitely forgot to say no whipped cream. That just means God wants me to have some whipped cream this morning. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you. Thanks, you too. Clear? What is that boring bullshit? I thought they were supposed to be blue. It's not that bad. I don't know what the hype was about. I really didn't know what coffee tasted like, huh? Two extra shots in that and it still tastes like straight milk. Somebody explain. I have a present for you. Okay. I got them tight. Ah! What a great a half day! I've been doing that ever since we did the TikTok. I wish I could find a Christmas music station. Spotify? I don't know how to do that. I already told you. It's an app on your phone. I have it, but I don't know how to... Type in Christmas playlist. Oh, really? Is that easy? Yeah. Good to know. We're on our way to Duncan's grooming appointment. He's getting to be handsome. Like he's he's all, not already like handsome? I just was going to say, he, not like he isn't already. You didn't let me finish. Okay. You no. didn't even bring your Diet Coke with you. Are you even grateful for it? For it? Am I grateful for a Diet Coke? Is that even a question that one should ask? Oliver, you chose this. You jumped out of the house. You chose it. What she said. Hey, enough. You could have stayed in the house and you wouldn't be having this problem right now, but you didn't need to hit me right there. That's not very nice. I was gonna hit you for the hell of it. I was doing a dance. <sighs> yeah, there's your old apartment complex. 
back on dirt roads, so it's gonna be noisy. Oh, it's 9.03, she probably thinks I forgot because I literally said that we needed to leave and you said, no, we don't need to leave yet. We didn't need to leave right then, but we needed to leave before we left. And we came out, we lost track. It, it, ah. I think it's your fault. My dog escaped because your dog would come your out other of the dog house. was scaring my dog. This is where it's she so lives. Cute. And then they got horses. Oh, it's a little mini horse. All right, now to get Duncan out without. Oh, I got it. Duncan! Okay, it's that time of year. Mom, mother. Coming. Hey, I have a question. Go for it. Why is there cute to. <laughs> um, Dad was cleaning something and it's gone. These are from your ears. They're not. If they're from my ears, they'd have yellow, gunky shit on them. Because I have bad ear wax. Now everybody knows. Do you want me to show you my bad ear wax? No. But you can show them your sweater. Oh, yes. Let it snow. Let it snow, Garfield. Let it snow. Meow, 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 meow. So this is where the Christmas tree's going. In that little spot. My mom has an absurd amount of Christmas decoration. Our goal is to get rid of some. But the Christmas tree must prevail. Let's get to it. Oh, oh, oh. Da, 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 da. Making our Christmas memories I've been working so much lately I can barely find the time to sleep Yeah, I spend my time running around Keeping people pleased But this is my favorite holiday It's a chance to start over new Cause I missed you so I'm letting go of everything but you You all right? No. Are you gonna be okay? Oh, she passed out in the kitchen, folks. She passed out in the kitchen. You'll be fine. Suck it up, buttercup. Da, 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 da. Making our Christmas memory. All right, guys, ready? This is Samantha after she cut her little finger on the tree because she wouldn't let someone help her. All right. Mom, it hurts so bad, look. Okay, <laughs> can we show them? I'm sorry that it hurts, but sometimes oh, you just have to be strong. She's squeezing it so it bleeds more. <laughs> oh my god, I've been sucking it out and it's still... Oh no. Oh, Jesus Christ. Faint number two of the day. Mommy. And you were afraid that Mommy, the treadmill is going to go through the floor? Do you have bubbles? No. Okay, I think the dogs think you're crazy. <laughs> I do too. We need a tetanus shot now. No, you don't. You've had a tetanus shot. Yes, I'm still alive. I put a band-aid on it. Some might say I was being dramatic, but I think those people just don't understand the pain. Time for the ornaments. This is the fun part. I'm gonna suck it up and make it through. Cute. There's not a single ornament on it. I haven't even thought about going to the store to get ornaments I also need to go to the store to get stuff to decorate my Jeep This is the not so fun part about vlogmas since you guys saw me mama Kelly decorating her tree We went and got some pizza and then I have been sitting right there on the couch editing I haven't moved it's 9 p.m. And I have finally finished that's just the hard truth about vlogmas a lot of your time is spent on a computer editing videos So there's a washer and dryer in this Airbnb. I never really gave you guys a tour of the Airbnb Did I this is it when you walk in then there's this hallway. That's the front door a coat rack a bench big enough for six at least there's two guest bedrooms this is the first guest bedroom guest bathroom this is the second guest bedroom i have room for four of you to come stay and it just leads into the main area of the house you guys this place looks so much bigger in real life than it did on the pictures they really like blue but you know what i'm here for it it's fine the kitchen 
I swear, even on camera, it doesn't show how big it is. Maybe that's because I've been living in an apartment and I'm not used to having space, but there's so much seating. I could have a whole party. People could sit here. This is a huge dining table and I have stools over here. Like, look at this. Look how cute this is. I couldn't have asked for a better place to stay this month. This is the bedroom I'm sleeping in. I still have things to put away, but bathroom. A shower, which I need to take one. This is a problem. I opened these because I'm, I basically need to wash all of this. So, let's do a load of laundry. I feel in my heart that that's the productive thing to do. A load of darts. It's like they knew who was coming. I have very sensitive skin and I'm allergic to almost every single laundry detergent. I'm talking allergic allergic. Full on hives. They have sensitive skin detergent. What are the odds? In you go. I'm kind of getting ready for bed. I need to feed my cat. I have an 18 year old cat, in case you didn't know. She's currently in, I don't even know what stage of kidney failure. There are a bunch of things that I have to do on a daily basis to make sure she feels good and is as healthy as she can be. And one of which is prescription kidney food that the vet prescribed her. Hi. That is what I'm doing. Okay, this is funny. So on my video day two, where I was curling my hair, like getting ready for my anniversary, a lot of you guys were telling me to get the Dyson Airwrap. I have it. And I suck at it. And even when I am able to figure it out, it doesn't stay. So I'm either doing something really wrong or I just don't know how to properly use it. If you have any air wrap tips, leave them below. It has felt like the longest day, but at the same time, I feel like I have not done anything. Quite the predicament. I really want to binge right now. I think I've had so much going on in the past week. It's all catching up to me. Vlogmas literally consists of filming everything, editing it, basically just a big cycle. I really just want to binge. But instead of binging, I'm gonna talk to you guys. I know that I will not get anything good out of binging. It is an emotional response that I need to try and fix and change and adjust. I haven't gone grocery shopping yet, so I have no food in this house, which is probably a good thing right now. Boy, do I really want some McDonald's. And it's so close too, but we're not gonna go. Mm -mm. Vlogmas for me has never been only the good things. I feel like I've always done a good job of being very realistic with what my life looks like. I think a reason that a lot of you guys remember 2019 is I was just a wreck. Unwell. I don't think there's a better word that can describe how I felt in 2019. I can very gratefully say that in 2021, I feel so much better and I've grown so much, but I still really struggle. And binging is just really hard to deal with and I don't wanna do it and I don't wanna give in. Honestly, I feel really safe coming to you guys, which is weird because there's so many of you and so many of you guys could judge me and be like, girl, just don't eat the food. But I know so many of you guys get it and even if you don't struggle with binging, you might struggle with alcohol or drugs or you're addicted to video games or maybe you're just mean. I don't know, like everyone has something that they struggle with. For me, it's freaking food when I'm Stress, anxious, emotional, overwhelmed. Because when I eat, I don't feel anything. I only am worried about the food. It's always been that way for me. So I had a really good day today though. I feel like I had a really good day today. I feel like I didn't do very much. I'm trying not to get too much in my head because after I was done editing, I was sitting there like, okay, what can I go film? Where can I go? What can I do to make this vlog more interesting? And I got nothing. This is what I want to do. I want to sit and relax and watch other people's Vlogmas videos. It's nice knowing that all of us are suffering together. Like everyone that's doing Vlogmas, we're all just as stressed out. For some reason that makes it a little bit easier. There's strength in numbers. Feels good to be back though. Especially having my own house and my own space. It does feel really good. I'm really afraid if I turn the camera off, I'm gonna go get in my car and go to McDonald's. There are times where that can be really embarrassing to admit, like food controls me so much sometimes. But it's not necessarily the food, it's just that release from having to feel so many emotions for so long. Even though the second you're done eating, you feel even worse because you just binged and it never helps. And that's something I try and remind myself when I 
feel like giving in. I'm extremely over my emotions, the way I only feel things in an extreme high and in an extreme low. And I really just wanna feel what it feels like to be normal and to just have like a steady stream of emotions. I mean, everyone's mood goes up and down a little bit, but I only am up here or down here and it's just so exhausting. I'm really considering medicine because I've been in therapy for a few months now and I feel so much better, but I don't wanna knock it before I have tried multiple different ones. Who knows, maybe it could be life changing for me. But for now, I'm just word vomiting at this point. Okay, I appreciate every single one of you guys for watching these. I'm still not really sure why you guys come back <laughs> and why you choose to click on my videos, but I appreciate you spending the day with me. I feel a lot less lonely when you guys are here with me. So we have a long ways to go. We're just getting started. 21 more days. But okay, I love you and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye. Bye.